With a client today, we talked about resistance. They are creating a new body of work. There has been some resistance in getting started. We had our first session out of four uh, last week and the job was to get started. They did get started, but there was resistance. I asked what it's about. It was about not knowing where things were going. Um, control. How do you allow yourself to go forward without knowing what the product is? And would knowing what the product is going to be actually be what you want? Would it actually produce something wonderful? And it's about allowing yourself to make mistakes. It's allowing yourself to go for what you want, to act on your desires, your intuitions, your impulses, and trust yourself to catch yourself if you fall, make a mistake, or change your mind, right? You have to learn to be kind enough to yourself and supportive enough to yourself to be able to explore. We talked about some ways that you can do this. And then also, I thought, you know what might be helpful is if we um, activate some of that masculine energy of control and structure, but just outside of that feminine energy of flow and intuition and the void space that then creates things, right? So I said, um, how about a schedule? for your time and how many hours you're going to give, how many days you're gonna to give to this new. We have an idea, right? We have an inspiration. Let's name it. Let's write it down. Let's make an outline, um, a battle plan, right? And then we now have structure, something we can check off. Like if we wanna do one painting a week, we can put a check mark when we've done so. We can check in with that structure and plan after we experience the flow and see if it's still containing us or if it needs to evolve. So really interesting stuff today.